and hello YouTube and welcome back to another episode of Zone TV Movie Entertainment. Well, today I wanted to talk about a couple of things here. I want to do my top 10 predictions of 2017. Now, these predictions could be wrong, probably be, or be wrong, or just probably be my weird, wild imagination, but I figure I'd just have some fun and just do it anyway. No particular order here, but these are the top 10 movie TV prediction of what's going to happen that I think could or should happen, or probably would happen. So, uh, number one, I think <clears throat> Star Wars Episode Eight will beat Avatar worldwide box office, I think. It, it's Star Wars, it's Episode Eight. this is going to be the darker one. This could be the Empire Strikes Back of the new trilogy. So, I'm looking forward to it. We're probably going to find out who Ray's parents are. We're going to see more of Luke Skywalker. We're definitely going to get a lot of Carrie Fisher, rest in peace, um, in this movie. And, um, yeah, I'm, I'm hoping that it breaks Avatar's record because Avatar needs to die. So, there you go. <clears throat> and number two, I think they're going to announce Green Lantern this time around. No, just saying, yeah, we probably, you said that last year. Yeah, I was, but it was a little too far. I could have sworn they were going to do that, but mm, whatever. I feel like this time around makes more sense because he's rumored to be in the movie. You know, in the teaser or the after credit or whatever it's going to be. He could, they could get the actor to come out on stage at Comic-Con and just wave to the crowd. Who knows? How Jordan, John Stewart, Gar Gardner, whoever it is, I just want to see Green Lantern already, so there you go. At number three, we're definitely, I believe we're going to get Captain Marvel director's announcement. They're going to start filming Avengers Infinity War pretty soon. Um, it only makes sense because Captain Marvel will appear in the movie. So they're going to have to get a director to know this character and get this character ready for her, her own movie. Because remember, Wonder Woman's going to come out soon. That's probably going to make a lot of money. And Marvel does not want to be far, far behind. That's the one thing that DC's doing right right now. There's a female that's superhero, so there you go. And I'm a person I don't care. Who they get, male, female, African American, I don't care, as long as they do a good job. And number four, I think before or when Spider Man Homecoming will get the, um, the first trailer or teaser for Thor Ragnarok. Um, this November it comes out. I'm looking forward to it. I kind of wish it comes out tonight, but let's see what happens. I think it's going to be great. Can't wait to see Hulk battle some of the aliens and kick some butt. Loki, Thor, and, you know, Loki, Thor, and I think Doctor Strange is going to be in it too. So, it's going to be mind-boggling how this movie turns out. And some Planet Hulk stuff in there too. Cannot wait. So, there you go. And number five, I think we're going to get some DC TV announcements. I don't know what they're going to announce. Maybe a new, maybe a Teen Titans live-action show. Young Justice, I mean, obviously we're getting Young Justice Season 3, finally, on Netflix or whatever. Um, you know, maybe the Legion of Superheroes, who knows. Maybe Superman will get his own TV show from the Supergirl world. Who knows, but I think we're going to get a new DC TV show announced sometime this year. So let's see what happens. At number 6, I think Ghost Rider is going to get his own TV show. Either on Netflix or NBC, ABC. Whatever. I think Ghost Rider has been very successful in Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. And I think he's going to get his own show. Right? If it's Ronnie, you know, the one with the car, or Johnny Blaze, whoever, Ghost Rider should be announced sometime this year. Hopefully. Um, that was number six. So number seven, I think the Fantastic Four are finally coming back to Marvel. I think it's done. I think Fox is going to be like, take it. We have Deadpool. We have the X-Men. We don't need Fantastic Four anymore. So, I'm hoping that they get them back. So maybe we can get another shot at them. And they'll probably be even better. So that's number seven. And number eight, I have Power Rangers actually being a pretty good movie. Yeah. I don't know why, but I have a feeling that this movie is going to be very profitable. And it's going to, you know, it might have some mixed reviews here and there from the critics, but I think a lot of people are still going to support and, you know, go try to see this movie out. And, you know, and it's going to make money. I think it's going to make money. 
to where they make a sequel. So I think that's what's going to happen. At number nine, Wonder Woman 2 is going to be a Nazi Comic Con. Yeah. Um, even though I think it'll be... I think Comic Con's before or after when Wonder Woman comes out of theaters, I think they'll still announce it right away because I think that movie's going to make a lot of money for DC and it's going to be the first female superhero movie. So that's going to be a good thing. And hopefully the critics treat it nicely. So let's see what happens there. And of course, at number 10, I think Man of Steel 2 is going to be announced with The Rock as the Black Adam. Yep, there's been a picture out there where Henry Cavill and Dwayne Johnson hanging out. So maybe that's setting up something. I don't know. Just taking a guess here. But yep, I think they, I think they have two, you know, DC has two unannounced movies for DC superheroes in 2018 and 19, I think Man of Steel is one of them. I, I think they're going to push back the Batman movie. Pains for you to say that. I think they're going to push it back because I think they're having problems with that and just move on with Man of Steel because I think Superman is the hardest film to make out of all of them. So you might as well get that one first. So there you go. There's my top 10 predictions. And number 10, Man of Steel is going to get announced. Nine, Wonder Woman is going to get announced. A, Power Rangers is going to be successful. Seven is Fantastic Four is going to come back to Marvel, Disney. Six, Ghost Rider TV show is going to get announced, whether it be Netflix or whatever. Uh, a new DC TV show might be announced. And number four, Thor 3 trailer is going to come out very soon. Maybe before or where Spider-Man Homecoming comes out. Uh, number three, Captain Marvel director will be announced. And number two, we're going to get Green Lantern's casting. And the number one Star Wars episode way will beat Avatar as the number one movie in the world, worldwide, not domestic, worldwide. It probably will beat episode seven too, but I'm saying worldwide. So leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think about my top ten predictions. And what do you think is going to happen? Leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think. Thank you and have a good day.